There is a tough reality that's coming into focus for us tonight on just how deadly this summer heat wave has been. Tonight, CBS News Texas learning the Dallas County Medical Examiner is investigating nearly 40 heat related deaths over the last three months. Our JD Miles gets us underway explaining why we may not have answers in these investigations for months. The extreme heat this summer is not only taking its toll on the environment, but also killing an alarming number of North Texans. The Dallas County Medical Examiner's Office has confirmed the first three deaths, including one child from heat related illnesses, and has yet to rule on 36 other suspected heat deaths. You know, it confirms what we're all experiencing. I mean, it's incredibly hot. Are these alarming numbers? It's absolutely serious. I mean, we. He, uh, heat stroke and death are, are things that happen uh, pretty much every season. It can take months, health officials say, to determine if hyperthermia resulted in a person's death, which is why Dr. Philip Wong says confirmed cases are just now being reported. You know, the medical examiner's office uh, has to do the investigation, so having to sort through all of that, if there are other medications or, you know, things like overdoses, uh, that might be related. So just having to sift through uh, and make that determination of what was the actual uh, cause of death. What can we take away from these numbers? Bottom line, it's hot and it's, you know, people need to do everything they can to uh, stay cool, stay well hydrated. Another concerning number to report is 1,330. That's how many people in Dallas County from May through this week have been treated at area hospitals for heat related illnesses. In Dallas tonight, J.D. Miles, CBS News, Texas.